on this slide is what I explained on the using the figure and you can read it uh, carefully on your own either uh, on the slide or in the book okay so let's look at an example of the global value numbering and what it can do so we have uh, parameters a and b and to the left is the input and to the right is the output of this algorithm a and b have unknown values so they are put in separate blocks and then uh, the constant one they it's uh, a, a one uh, block with constant one and then all add instructions are put in the same block and uh, this add will be removed uh, from the block uh, and uh, these two will remain in the same block and uh, this one will also be removed in the end since um, they are in the same block and uh, the first dominates the second the second can re be removed and instead the assignment to y can be done by copying the value from x that copy statement can also be removed okay so in the end the code will look like this. This is quite fascinating since there is no assignment between x and y uh, in the or, or, uh, original function.